BRP Tubataha MRRV 4401 2026 Philippine Patrol Boat 2026 Welcome back to the channel, and today we are diving deep into one of the most important and powerful maritime assets of the Philippines in 2026, the BRP Tubataha with hull number MRRV 4401. This patrol boat is not just another ship in the fleet, it represents the evolving strength, modernization, and strategic vision of the Philippine Coast Guard and Maritime Security Forces. As regional waters become more complex and maritime responsibilities grow, vessels like BRP Tubataha play a critical role in protecting national interests, safeguarding marine resources, and ensuring safety at sea. The BRP Tubataha is named after the world-famous Tubataha Reefs Natural Park, a UNESCO World Heritage Site and one of the most biodiverse marine areas on the planet. By carrying this name, the vessel symbolizes not only defense and security but also environmental protection and stewardship of the seas. In 2026, this ship stands as a reminder that modern patrol boats must balance law enforcement, humanitarian missions, and ecological responsibility all at the same time. Designed as a multi-role response vessel, the BRP Tubataha is built to handle a wide range of missions. Unlike traditional patrol boats that focus on a single role, this vessel is engineered to respond quickly and effectively to multiple scenarios. From maritime law enforcement and anti-smuggling operations to search and rescue missions during natural disasters, the BRP Tubataha is a true all-rounder. This flexibility is especially important for the Philippines, an archipelago with more than 7,000 islands and vast maritime zones that demand constant monitoring. In terms of design, the BRP Tubataha reflects modern naval architecture. Its hull is optimized for stability and endurance, allowing it to operate effectively even in rough sea conditions. The ship's profile is sleek and functional, emphasizing efficiency rather than aggressive appearance. Every design choice, from the hull shape to the superstructure layout, is intended to enhance operational performance while minimizing maintenance requirements. This is crucial for long deployments and continuous patrol missions across wide maritime areas. Powering the BRP Tubataha is a reliable propulsion system that provides both speed and fuel efficiency. The vessel is capable of maintaining high cruising speeds for extended periods, allowing it to intercept suspicious vessels quickly or reach distress locations without delay. At the same time, its engines are designed to be fuel efficient, reducing operational costs and increasing overall mission endurance. In 2026, efficiency is just as important as raw power, and this ship balances both effectively. One of the standout features of the BRP Tubataha is its advanced navigation and communication systems. Equipped with modern radar, GPS, and integrated bridge systems, the crew has full situational awareness at all times. These systems allow the vessel to track other ships, monitor weather conditions, and coordinate seamlessly with other units and command centers. Secure communication links ensure real-time information sharing, which is essential during joint operations with the Navy, Air Force, or international partners. Surveillance capabilities are another major strength of this patrol boat. The BRP Tubataha is fitted with modern sensors that can detect and identify vessels at long ranges, both day and night. Electro-optical and infrared systems enable effective monitoring even in low visibility conditions. This is particularly important in combating illegal fishing, smuggling, and other maritime crimes that often occur under the cover of darkness. With these tools, the crew can gather evidence, track targets, and respond decisively. When it comes to armament, the BRP Tubataha is not designed as a heavy combat vessel, but it carries sufficient defensive and enforcement weaponry to handle its missions. Typically equipped with mounted machine guns and other non-lethal options, the ship can enforce maritime laws while minimizing unnecessary escalation. The focus is on deterrence, control, and protection rather than outright combat. This approach aligns with the vessel's role as a Coast Guard asset rather than a frontline warship. The crew accommodations on board the BRP Tubataha are designed with long missions in mind. Comfortable living quarters, proper ventilation, and modern facilities help maintain crew morale and efficiency. In 2026, crew welfare is recognized as a critical factor in operational success. A well-rested and motivated crew can perform better, respond faster, and make better decisions under pressure. The ship's layout ensures that daily operations, maintenance, and rest periods can be conducted smoothly even during extended deployments. One of the most important roles of the BRP Tubataha is maritime law enforcement. The Philippines faces ongoing challenges such as illegal fishing, human trafficking, drug smuggling, and unauthorized maritime activities. 
This vessel acts as a mobile law enforcement platform, capable of boarding suspect ships, conducting inspections, and enforcing national and international laws. Its presence alone serves as a strong deterrent, signaling that Philippine waters are actively monitored and protected. Search and rescue operations are another area where the BRP Tubataha truly shines. The Philippines is frequently affected by typhoons, storms, and maritime accidents. In such situations, speed, coordination, and onboard medical capability can mean the difference between life and death. The BRP Tubataha is equipped to assist distressed vessels, rescue survivors, and provide immediate aid. Its deck space allows for the deployment of small boats and rescue equipment, making it highly effective in emergency scenarios. Humanitarian assistance and disaster response missions are also a key part of the ship's operational profile. In the aftermath of natural disasters, coastal and island communities often rely on maritime assets for relief and support. The BRP Tubataha can transport supplies, medical teams, and essential equipment to affected areas. Its ability to operate in shallow waters and approach remote islands makes it especially valuable during relief operations. In 2026, such capabilities are more important than ever as climate-related disasters become increasingly frequent. Environmental protection is deeply tied to the identity of this vessel. Named after the Tubataha reefs, the ship plays an active role in protecting marine ecosystems. This includes monitoring marine protected areas, preventing illegal fishing practices, and responding to pollution incidents such as oil spills. The vessel's sensors and onboard equipment allow it to detect environmental threats early and coordinate response efforts with other agencies. This reinforces the idea that maritime security is not only about defense but also about preserving natural heritage. The BRP Tubataha also contributes to regional and international cooperation. In 2026, maritime security is increasingly a shared responsibility. This patrol boat regularly participates in joint exercises, training missions, and coordinated patrols with neighboring countries and international partners. These activities help build trust, improve interoperability, and promote stability in the region. By operating alongside allied vessels, the BRP Tubataha represents the Philippines as a capable and responsible maritime nation. Training is another important aspect of the vessel's role. Serving as a platform for skill development, the BRP Tubataha helps train new generations of Coast Guard personnel. From navigation and engineering to law enforcement and emergency response, the ship provides a real-world environment for hands-on learning. This ensures that the Philippine Coast Guard maintains a high level of professionalism and readiness well into the future. In 2026, the strategic value of the BRP Tubataha cannot be overstated. The Philippines occupies a critical position in Southeast Asia, with busy sea lanes and complex maritime boundaries. Patrol boats like this one help assert sovereignty, monitor territorial waters, and respond to emerging threats. While it may not attract the same attention as larger warships, its day-to-day -day presence is what truly secures the seas. Technological integration is another reason why this vessel stands out. Modern command and control systems allow the BRP Tubataha to operate as part of a larger network. Information from satellites, aircraft, and other ships can be shared instantly, creating a comprehensive maritime picture. This network-centric approach enhances decision-making and allows for faster, more coordinated responses to incidents at sea. Maintenance and sustainability have also been considered in the design and operation of the BRP Tubataha. Built with durable materials and supported by efficient logistics, the ship is designed to remain operational with minimal downtime. This is especially important for a country that relies heavily on its patrol fleet for continuous maritime presence. In 2026, sustainability is not just about the environment but also about maintaining long-term operational capability. The public image of the BRP Tubataha is equally important. As a visible symbol of maritime authority, the vessel helps build public confidence in the country's ability to protect its waters. Community engagement, court visits, and educational outreach further strengthen the connection between the Coast Guard and the citizens it serves. This relationship is essential for promoting maritime awareness and cooperation. Looking toward the future, the BRP Tubataha represents a step forward in the modernization of the Philippine Maritime Forces. It reflects lessons learned from past operations and incorporates modern technology to meet current and future challenges. As threats evolve and responsibilities expand, ships like this will continue to adapt and serve as the backbone of maritime security. In conclusion, the BRP Tubataha MRRV 4401 in 2026 is far more than just a patrol boat. 
It is a multi-role platform designed to protect, rescue, enforce, and preserve. From safeguarding territorial waters and supporting humanitarian missions to protecting marine ecosystems and strengthening international cooperation, this vessel embodies the diverse responsibilities of modern maritime forces. Its presence at sea ensures that the Philippines remains vigilant, capable, and prepared to face the challenges of an ever-changing maritime environment. If you found this deep dive into the BRP Tubataha informative, make sure to support the channel by liking the video, sharing it with others who are interested in naval and maritime topics, and subscribing for more in-depth content on modern ships, patrol boats, and defense technology. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned for more powerful stories from the seas.